Hey, you guys. How's it going? Welcome to another uh, podcast. Today, I'm talking with Badger. Hello there. <laughs> uh, and Badger was one of the first people that found the channel and has stuck with the channel. He came on for like zombies content because that's what I was streaming, and then I was like, "Hey, just kidding. We're gonna go, we're gonna go to Kingdom Hearts, which is <laughs> yeah, completely just, different." Let's just swap over real quick. <laughs> it's not gonna go back, by the way. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Goodness. <clears throat> um. So yeah, I guess the the first question. So, uh, when you found me, I was doing zombie content, uh, like streams, and my brother was making something. <laughs> so how did you how did you find the channel in the first place? I know. Well, um, oh, go ahead. How did I find the channel? Yeah. So, like, I know you found was, the stream, but yeah, like, did yeah, it just I like was pop going up? through? You know, I was going through YouTube gaming. I'm like, hey, I wonder if I can find anybody playing, you know, like Origins or Zombie Chronicles through this time at night, I guess. And I'm like, oh, hey, you know, this guy's um, playing it. And like, I, I decided to join, and I thought, you know, this guy's pretty cool. I should help him out with, you know, this Easter egg and stuff. Ended up helping you, ended up becoming friends and stuff like this. And I guess I kind of encourage your channel to. Oh yeah, definitely. Grow, yeah, because like, so that I I've said this a couple times. That like Zombie Chronicles stream was like the last hurrah of the channel, kind of. Like me and my brother were like burned out. We hadn't seen any growth. Like we were like, okay, like we're we're getting close to like the end of college. We might as well just kind of wrap it up. And it was fun. And then like someone came in. Like wasn't active and engaging, and I was like, "Oh, this is what YouTube's supposed to be about." <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it was Origins. I had never played Origins before, so I had no idea what I was doing. But uh, yeah, that was fun because like, like you were you looking up uh, steps online, and you were like, "Oh, um, I knew some of the first steps by memory because I used to play Origins a lot with uh, mm -hmm. one of my friends." So that's. Did you? Yeah, that's that's how I memorized the first part of that, and then I went online and decided to check some stuff out. Because I think we put together the the fire staff, and I was like, "This is yeah. awesome! I've never put together one of the staffs." Because I would literally like I would get to the first like generator, or I'd like do some of the generators, and then the Panzer would come and I would die, and that was it. <laughs> so, uh, so you're into zombies. What what got you into zombies, and like, what's your experience or? Uh, yeah, what's your experience with zombies? What got me into zombies? Probably, mm. I think World at War. World at War was a major turning point really? in my like, gaming career. I, okay. Career, quote unquote. Um, I really just liked the style of it. I just really enjoyed playing zombies. So from World at War, did you go to uh, like Black Ops and Black oh, Ops 2? Yeah, I went from, from World at War, I went straight to Black Ops 1. That was my... Mm. That was one of my favorite games, one of the more interactive games that I would play with friends a lot. You know, Black Ops 1, Modern Warfare 2. I had uh, a friend and his sister come over a lot, uh -huh. and we would all play, like, um, I think it was Rust on Modern Warfare 2, and we would oh. have sniper battles and all that kind of stuff. It was, <laughs> That's awesome. it was fun times. Yeah. Okay, so it wasn't just, like, zombies. You you liked all of Call of Duty. Oh, yeah. Okay. I, I liked all most of Call of Duty. Some some of the bits of the campaign I didn't really like. Some of the what? Camping? Campaign. Oh uh, campaign, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. What um so are you still into Call of Duty? Like have you played World War Two and the other well, one? I mean I haven't I haven't been able to play World War Two since I you know, I don't have it in my game inventory. So on uh, Steam anyway. Gotcha. Can I you... might be getting it, but it depends on you know, if I want to play it 24-7 or not, so. Yeah, gotcha. I have World of War installed, though, so that's, that's fun. <laughs> that's all you need. Because, <coughs> well, well, do you have custom zombies with that? Um, I, I'm i not sure. I don't think that was implemented in World of War. Oh, it wasn't. Oh, I thought it was. Maybe. I have to check. Maybe later. Yeah, my brother got really into custom zombies. He started to make his own zombie map for world at war and then actually when black ops 3 had uh zombie custom tools whatever come out me and my brother started working on a map together i don't know if i don't know what time that was i think that was before we had started to like gain a following so we had like a whole story written out and i had started like modeling and setting up the map that lasted for like two weeks <laughs> it's not not a long time at all 
So, have, did you get to play Black Ops Three then, or um, what? What games did you stop off at with Call of Duty? What game did I stop off at? Probably Infinite Warfare. Infinite Warfare, most likely. Okay, and that's because the that's that's the uh, fucking space one. Space one. Okay, yeah. that's that's the one with the the zombie crew that like jumps yeah. to different movies yeah, yeah yeah okay okay cool cool i knew that one i didn't play a lot of it i think i fell off actually like halfway through that because um <laughs> funny story it's my just... friend my friend bought uh i think he bought it for me to play because he had a pc but he didn't have a ps4 and so we'd always try to do easter egg hunts with me and i just like never did and so I felt really bad because he like bought this game for me to play with him, and then we like played it twice. It was bad. Just, just twice. Yeah. yeah. So, I play because I I didn't really enjoy it. It was, it was all right. I just I don't know something was just off about it. It's not like the OG Call of Duty, you know. Yeah. All the good, good, memorable things from it. Yeah. So I'm hoping Black Ops Four kind of brings it back to the zombies I like. Yeah, to me, I feel like Black Ops 4 is just a repeat of Black Ops 3 with right? more added stuff. Yeah, like, like it a seems... grappling hook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It seems, it seems very... unnecessary. Seems unnecessary? Unnecessary. Okay. You know, to add like a grappling hook and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, I didn't really understand. I tried to, because I got to play a little bit of the, the beta, and it was interesting. Didn't really make much sense. <clears throat> but, uh,. Yeah, it just seems like Black Ops 3, except they, like, took some things away and then, like, tweaked a couple things. It's, like, an updated Black Ops 3 with a few different features. Yeah, so I don't I don't know how I feel about it yet. I'll have to wait and see. I'm not. I'm probably not going to play it anyways, but <laughs> uh, I, I am excited for the zombies because Mob of the Dead's coming back. So that's I exciting. Mob of the Dead. Yeah, that was me and my brother played that a lot with uh, one of our friends. That's how that's how we got into zombies, I think. Well, that's like that's one of the bigger maps we played. So, what's your favorite map then? My favorite map? Mm -hmm. I'm, hmm, I'm probably gonna have to go back to my old World at War. And just say knock to their untold. <laughs> really? Okay, cool. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think. I like I liked Mob of the Dead. I don't know if that's my favorite. I really like, um. Zetsubo no Shima. I don't know if you saw that one in Black Ops 3. It's the, yeah, the, the, yeah. the swamp one. I don't know why. That one just was really interesting. It was very like mysterious and kind of creepy. Yeah, that's that's in uh, World at War 2, I think. Not Zetsubo no Shima is? Yeah, I think so. Or a different, uh, an earlier version of it, I believe. I oh, thought so. Oh, I feel yeah, like there's yeah, a yeah. swamp one. There is that yeah, swamp, swamp one. one. I can't remember what it's called. Um... Yeah, I do remember that. Well, Shinonuma. Shinonuma, that's right. Um, and Black Ops 1, I liked Moon. I sucked at Moon, but I loved the idea of going to space. I always died in that Just one, though. <laughs> battling zombies in space. Yeah, it was bad. Like, I would die in, like, round two, I think, if I even got there. I'm not, I, I'm not a good zombies player, I don't think. I like to think I am, and then I start playing, and I die automatically, so... It's like, oh, I'm going to be great at this. Just gone. <laughs> yep. I think there was one point where I was good. That that point has left. <laughs> so um, so what what are some uh, YouTubers you watch then? Or Some YouTubers I watch? Some zombie YouTubers. I mean, some zombie YouTubers. Oh, man. I have to really think about that. I've... <laughs> I've kind of stopped watching zombie YouTubers because nobody really uploads zombies anymore. Really? Oh, wow. Which is unfortunate <laughs> since it was, it was a fun, you know, experience. Zombies and all that stuff. It's yeah. like introducing a new game mode that nobody's ever seen before, and everybody's just, uh -huh. you know, taking that for granted as if you know it wasn't that important. Yeah, yeah. It's it's interesting to see how fast people jump ship. <clears throat> It's um, like people uh, went from the modern era all the way to futuristic, and then some people want to go back to World War Two, World War One. I'd like to see a World War One game, probably. Yeah, well, they went back to World War Two, and everyone hated it. So I don't know if that's just like the developers, like just didn't do a good job of 
making a good zombies experience or campaign or if like they just don't actually know what they want <laughs> well i mean with me I, I feel like i can play any game and be satisfied just because it's something that i can play something that i right? can get my hands on something that i can yeah it's new actually do stuff with mm -hmm. um what was i gonna say shoot i had a question i forgot it what were we talking about oh uh, zombie YouTubers. Yeah, I really loved the uh, what's his name? One of the guys I really liked was the Smith plays. I don't know if you've seen him or watched um, his content. Um, I used to like him a lot. <clears throat> he was really fun. Uh, I haven't seen a lot of his stuff lately, but uh, I liked him. I'm trying to think of who else I liked. I liked <clears throat> man. I can't even think right now. Zombie YouTubers. I like Noah J. He was cool. Like it was nice to kind of like no throw on. Uh, that's somebody I remember. <laughs> that like because I could just like throw on one of his streams and you're like, hey, like there's not gonna be like a whole lot of language or like anything bad, so like I don't have to, I don't know, like be like paranoid that like someone's gonna be around me and he's gonna like say something and I don't know. He's I'm always like, drop a sudden f bomb. Yeah, like I'm always like so. Just embarrassed if like I if someone like says a curse word while around someone else. So, I don't know. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, I like Noah J. I liked the Smith plays. Uh, they were they were fun to watch. But I think they're I I want to say they're doing Fortnite now. Is that right? Uh yeah, everyone's doing Fortnite now. But um, I guess. I can see why. I mean, it brings in a lot of revenue. It's also a very yeah. mainstream game today. Yeah, definitely. Uh, do you and, play a lot of Fortnite? I mean, sometimes it's just it depends on my mood mm. at this point because you know it. People people don't like it because it's cartoony. They just don't like the building aspect. They don't like the fact that people can get the high ground in a matter of like seconds because the tryhards that build in this game. But mm. um. It's it's a fun game if you can get your hands on the ropes of it. Yeah. Yeah, I noticed because I've played it a couple times. Um, and I, I noticed that, like, if you don't build, you're you're pretty much dead. <laughs> uh, yeah, unless unless you know how to counter buildings, which I, I've done pretty well because I'm... Counter buildings? What does that mean? Well, it's like, it's, it's like you shoot the bottom of their building and everything falls down and stuff like that. Oh, so okay. that's, that's basically my tactic because I don't, I'm not that good at building. I'm like a garbage tier builder. So <laughs> well, I just like panic. It's like, there's like too many like options. Not, there's not too many options. options is shoot or build. But I just like yeah. panic when someone starts shooting at me. Like, I don't think, oh, I should like build up a wall to like save myself. Yeah. That's, that's how I play a lot. I am when I first started playing the game, somebody would shoot at me and my heart would just jump. I'm like, oh, I am being shot at. I <laughs> yeah, started right. jumping and spinning, trying to look for somebody. And then I just ended up getting killed almost immediately. So yeah. then that's something I had to get used to. I had to get used to, like, you know, um, calming myself down when in that situation, just saying, oh, well, I need to pinpoint this person's location from where they shot me from and then yeah. try and counter them. Yeah, and you die really fast. That's one thing that makes me sad. Enough. Yeah, it's like enough. really, really fast. I'm like, what the heck? <laughs> um, yeah, so, um, I yeah, I did Fortnite. I did a lot uh, Call of Duty in the past, um, and then we changed to Kingdom Hearts. And had you have you ever played? Had you ever had you ever heard of Kingdom Hearts before? Like we made the switch. I mean, I've heard of it. I just didn't really know what it was i didn't really know i if i would be interested in it and yeah. stuff like that so, so i didn't, what was your I didn't initial... really i didn't really look into it but then when you started like you know streaming it and stuff like that and i would start watching it a lot and I'm like oh this, this is pretty interesting I, w I would play this like a lot in my spare time uh-huh <clears throat> so yeah like what were your initial thoughts when you like <laughs> when it was like one day you're like oh we're playing call of duty the next it's like oh Completely different yeah. game. <laughs> completely different game. Completely different controls. Completely different aspects. It's yeah. just like, oh, family friendly. Got it. <laughs> yeah. When I when it was like zombies and you just saw the zombies and it just goes to Kingdom Hearts and I'm like, what the heck? That doesn't. <laughs> yeah. 
That doesn't look familiar. <laughs> this isn't zombies. So yeah, what were your like initial thoughts like watching or seeing the shift from uh, uh, Call of Duty to Kingdom Hearts? Shift from COD to Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. yeah. My my initial reaction was, you know, well, even if I don't like it, I might as well give it a try. If I if I won't like it, then maybe I can just you know still stick around, you know, watch the person, talk sure. to people. That's like yeah. rare on and YouTube. <laughs> people people usually just go, oh, that guy's streaming something that I don't like. I'm not gonna watch him because he's trash. And like, <laughs> you know, that's that's not a way to think because you know maybe that person's really nice. Um, <clears throat> yeah, and you mentioned like family friendly content. I never uh. I don't really like care you've per never, se. You've never really strayed from family friendly, to be honest. You don't really cuss a lot. Yeah, unless I play a horror game, then I'm like a or, wuss. Or or you, <laughs> or, or you keep dying. Yeah. On the boss. <clears throat> Goodness, our voice keeps going out. Or yeah, or if I get really triggered, like if I've had like a long day at work or like a, uh, like just I'm extremely tired, I get so triggered. It's bad. <clears throat> Like, yeah, I sent a application. So the university that I'm at is, like, super, like, strict, and they don't like anything. And so, <laughs> um, so they're, like, super weird about cursing. And, like, right when I, like, applied was this point when I was doing level one, I think, or one of the Cabin of Remembrance, which is in Kingdom Hearts 2. And I was so triggered, and I was cursing so much, and I would uploaded it. And, like, they didn't know anything about my YouTube channel or anything. But, like, I think I had mentioned to somebody that at the university. I was like, oh, yeah, like, I do this kind of content. And I can, like, talk to to these kind of people. And he's like, oh, interesting. And I was like, oh, Lord, I hope he doesn't look it up. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> so he didn't say anything. So I don't think he did. Um, but, uh, so, yeah, I'm always worried, like, my school's Someone's gonna hear you, right? My school's gonna like find some kind of content that's associated with me, and I'll just be like cursing everywhere. Just, this dude said the f word, <laughs> banned. Yeah. So. Um, speaking of university slash college, um, back on the school topic, uh, I was I'm I'm in ninth grade, but at this point, I'm taking college level welding classes. Ooh, cool. And graphic design. That's awesome. What uh, I didn't know you were into graphic design. That's cool. Are the profile pictures that you've been making? I know. I know the one you have right now is made by Leon. Yeah. But the previous ones that you've been putting up were those drawings that you had made, or a few of them, but awesome. not all of them. So you've been getting a channel set up because I know you've had some issues with uh, like getting hardware that actually like runs games <laughs> yeah yeah and on top of that you know like youtube wanted to you know make sure i couldn't upload or stream anything for 24 hours before they did that i'm like mm, yeah that's nice really um, wait what yeah they, they uh they put a block and they're like oh you can't stream or upload anything for 24 hours unless we verify you and i'm like mm, okay, uh, that's... gotcha that's frustrating yeah um yeah, because I remember Even, a little bit ago, you were working on a computer, and then, yeah. like, the guy did I don't because someone was building it for you, right? And then, like, yeah, they somebody, gave you, like, a really old graphics card? They gave me integrated graphics, and it was an old motherboard. It was a really old motherboard, something uh, from, like, 2006. Oh, Lord. Yeah, I'm like, dude, what are you putting in my computer? So... <laughs> I recently got a new motherboard installed, with a new hard drive. Awesome. A better graphics card. Yeah. So, oh, I got one terabyte of space now, so that's cool. great. That's awesome. That'll come in handy. So, yeah. um, so what what kind of content are you looking to upload? I'm gonna be honest. I'm not sure yet. I don't. I'm I'm thinking of you know. You know, making videos with other people mm -hmm. doing like playing games with other people stuff like that so yeah um so when are you starting your youtube channel when am i going to start my youtube channel mm -hmm. whenever i can find you know i guess the time and quiet 
space to actually start. Mm -hmm. You know, when I can get my own room, stuff like that. When I can, you know, gotcha. get everything set up to where it's quiet and mm -hmm. there's no interruptions, stuff like that. Gotcha. Which would probably be in like, um, <laughs> <laughs> sometime I'm in the far sure. future. <laughs> yeah, sometime in the far future when I would just either, say, okay, sorry, go ahead. Either when we build on, mm -hmm. you know, to the house to build a room, or my grandma passes away and I get her room. Gotcha. I would say, um, just just go for it. I've seen a couple YouTubers that, like, they just are upfront, like, hey, like, I'm in a small house. We have a lot of people, like. I apologize for like background noise, but like this is, that's just how it is. <laughs> so, so I mean, you yeah, could you could try that. Um, on on top of the background noise, there's always people coming up to me, poking me, stuff like that. I'm like, stop, <laughs> stop it. Oh really? <laughs> just like a hissing, just stop. <laughs> like a badger. <laughs> do badgers hiss? I think badgers hiss. I'm pretty sure they do. Uh, American badgers, maybe. Maybe. Um, I forgot we have podcast questions. We can we can go over that. So yeah, so first podcast question, are you a real badger? Um I am not legally required to answer that question. <laughs> oh man. Uh yeah, we asked, uh, do you have claws? Um I used to have claws actually. Which, really? Yeah. Unless you count not in long nails as claws. <laughs> uh, do you badger people a lot? I I remember using that word a lot. That that pun. Mm. <laughs> did I did I drag you into this? <laughs> um. Uh. Give a long pause. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I'll leave a, a link in the description to Badger's channel, um, so you guys can subscribe if you want to, and he'll um, put out stuff when he has a chance to. Um, I I didn't get a, a yeah. What kind of content are you doing? You're doing uh, like Call of Duty, Fortnite. I'll probably or... do for I'll probably do Fortnite, Call of Duty, all this different mix of stuff. You know, I mm. have friends that play Fortnite. I have friends that play Call of Duty. I'll probably do solo um solo streams for World at War Zombies, maybe. Okay, cool, cool. And maybe uh, I I'm pretty sure it has custom zombies, so that could be a lot of stuff you could play with. Um, just mess around. Mm -hmm. So. Well, yeah, thank you so much for doing this. Um, and I just completely blanked on how to end this, so I'll see you guys Yeet. later. <laughs> uh, if you guys enjoyed, why not uh, consider sharing this with someone you think will like it. Um, again, check out Badger's channel if you want to see some Fortnite or Call of Duty World at War stuff. And yeah, uh, you can see the previous podcast by clicking on the card in the top left, probably, I think, if. There's an end screen on this. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Oh, <laughs> Lord. <laughs> uh, best ending ever. Oh, yeah. <laughs>